All right, now let's line these up. So as I look at this, I'm going to have to guess. I could, you know, open this in some other piece of software and try to do some measuring. My guess is that there is an extension here that will let me look at this live and uh, do some honest to God pixel measuring. But I'm going to eyeball it because I think it's such a short amount and it'll be easy to do. Um, I'm going to first guess 10 pixels because that's maybe what it looks like. So since I cannot change the uh, margins or padding on this because they're all in the body tag. Where is my styles? There it is. Because they're all in the body tag. Let's beautify this while we're here. Much nicer. Um, if these were in their own individual divs, I could put some margins or padding or deal with them like that. But right now they're in the body, so let's style them here. Um, and just to remind you that the order of things in the background tag is going to be first color, which we don't have here, so that's not there, then image, then repeat, and then actually after repeat would be attachment if we're going to attach anything. I think you remember that tutorial where we attached an image. And then position. So an acronym for that might be C-I-R-A-P. Key wrap. <laughs> Color, image, repeat, attachment, position. So instead of left here, let's try 10px. Do a save and a refresh. Oh, look, it moved it over. It's so close, but it's not perfect. So let's try 11px. Save, refresh. Oh, close, but no cigar. Let's try 12. Oops, go back. Let's try 12 and hope, hope, hope. Save and refresh. There it is. All right, so now we know it's 12 pixels over. Uh, let's go back here. So on this one, whose default position is left top, right? It's left top. So we're going to do the same thing. We'll type 12px. And we do have to add the word top because otherwise it will go to the center. Save and refresh. There we go. I could also, by the way, put a zero here. These could all be numbers. Save, refresh. Should be no change. Yep. So uh, that's our story here with lining these up. In the next video, we'll rein in this text and get some paragraph images.